Hello again, so I'm back with question number 13 from the first paper and this is um, area scale factor question. So let's see it. We've got two pots, pot A and pot B. You notice that we've got the height of each pot annotated on the diagram. It says pot A and pot B are mathematically similar. That means they're enlargements of each other. And the area of the base of pot B is 160 centimeters squared. So I'm gonna do that here. And I wanna work out the area of the base of pot A. So first step we have to do is work out what's the linear scale factor. So the linear scale factor we work out by doing what's one linear side. So I have to make sure the, the this is a height right so it's linear it doesn't have two or three dimensions it's not an area and it's not a volume so it's a linear unit so i'm gonna do what's the the side what's the height of the big pot divided by the height of the small pot so it's 10 over 8 i'm not taking any chances i'm dictating my calculator so that's 5 over 4 also known as 1.25 so this is the linear scale factor uh, what we're looking for though is the area scale factor because we're dealing with areas in the actual question so the area scale factor is equal to the linear scale factor squared so the area scale factor is going to be 1.25 squared so what we want to do now is we're going from the area of the base of the big pot to the area of the base of the small pot. This means that we're gonna be dividing by our scale factor. If so, that's a division. If we were going from the small pot to the big pot, then we'd be multiplying by the scale factor, but we're not. So the area of the base of the big pot divided by the area scale factor. So 1.25 squared, mustn't forget the squared. So in my calculator, of course, divided by 1.25 squared equals 102.4, which is our final answer. And we're done. I'll see you in a minute for question number five on the second paper you guys got to practice. Bye.